Every summer, the Scripps Howard Fund and News 5 help get books into the hands of children in need through our If You Give a Child a Book campaign. Several months after Wade Park School in Cleveland received its 500,000 book from the campaign, I stopped by to see the impact it is having on students there. What struck me most about my visit to Wade Park School is that the feelings of excitement. It felt special because I, I saw all the kids having fun. And appreciation. It like makes my heart warm. Are still very strong several months after Kalea Harris. I like books. I like read them a lot. Along with her classmates. Lots of kids, they, they don't know what things are until they read books. Got the chance to shop at a Scholastic Book Fair. There were so many different types of books we could choose. At absolutely no cost. Most of our children have one or two books before we got those donations last year. Last year they were able to get four new books. Wade Park assistant principal Sandra Powers. It's really made a big difference. Tells me seeing more books in the hands of her students is not only great for sparking their imaginations, but it vastly improves their language skills. I know a lot of our children come to school with maybe 500 word vocabulary where some of their Suburban counterparts come with 5,000 word vocabulary. That's actually one of the highlights of reading for Kalea. She enjoys coming across new words and adding them to her vocabulary. Helps it out and makes it bigger. With so many children in Cleveland living in poverty, Powers tells me without the If You Give a Child a Book campaign, owning new books would be out of reach for a lot of her students. Some of those books were nine, 10, 11 dollars a piece. So that could feed your family for an evening. So you're not gonna get that book. Thanks to the generosity of the Scripps Howard Fund, News 5 employees, and donations from the community, we can purchase as many as four books for every $10 collected. They couldn't believe it. They never had 30 some dollars worth of books, brand new in their hand. For this sixth grader, the outpouring of support has not gone unnoticed. I think it's actually really nice and generous of them to try to help kids it's kids learn how to read and get more books to try to expand their home library. So great being out there and seeing the impact this campaign is having firsthand. Now, if you'd like to contribute to our If You Give a Child a Book campaign, you can visit news5cleveland.com slash give a book. And you can also donate by texting WEWS to 50155. Now, every $5 provides one book for a child in need.